How y'all doing, Waymakers? How y'all doing today? Welcome back to RV Away. If you're new here, I'm a little Carl, and I live an RV life. I live in an RV. I travel around. I bounce around. Today, I actually have an amazing announcement. Okay, I'm headed. I'm headed to lunch. Been at work, as y'all can see. <laughs> Let me tell y'all what the announcement is. So this bad boy is gonna be a lot bigger of a project. Okay, this is gonna be a huge project. You know, the 1979, 20 feet by like eight feet, a, a big project. On the back end though, we got this guy. New project, man. New project slash new home, new camper, new everything. Are y'all as excited as I am? I'm a little tired, it was hard to get it on there. I know the wind is probably kicking, but man, what a view, what a view. Hopefully I'm in it. Look how pretty. The new pop-up camper, man. What? <laughs> yup, that's the new baby right there. That is the new gal. So we got a new little project. So first of all, I wanna apologize for lacking on my renovations. I know it's been a while. I've been kind of lacking. Um, things take a lot of money. Things take a lot of planning and it's hard to do. I still have to live. I just paid for a cruise coming up in August, so be on the lookout for that. So I will be cruising in August, so subscribe, hit the bell so you know when that happens. But until the cruise, that's why a lot of my money went, like 700 something dollars over the past month. So yeah, like I said, I be busy. I be trying to do things. I got a lot of great content coming for y'all. And so yeah, we're gonna be doing like a lot smaller renovations on that one, making it to where we can actually take it out and enjoy ourselves, have a good time. We're gonna have a camping trip within the next month. Mark my words. Only problem I have right now is there's no crank handle. So I don't really have a way to crank it up besides buying another crank handle. And the crank is the weirdest size. Let me show you what the crank looks like. Sorry, not the crank, but this is the receiver, the female end, I guess you would say, or the male end. And you see it has like these little notches, but it's mostly kind of like this weird oval. And so with it being that weird oval, all the cranks I can find online are square. And I'm really scared that the square will not fit. I could be wrong, you know, I could be nervous for nothing. I just don't feel like the square will fit. So I wanna try one or rent or, you know, borrow someone's before I use, before I buy one. And it's gonna take a little bit of time. Also, if you know what will fit that, please link it below. Link it below. I can put it on the wish list or I can go ahead and try to buy it depending on how expensive it is. But yeah, if you know what will crank that thing up, link it to me. Even if it's like one of those adapter pieces that go on the end of a drill, link it to me, please. We have some corded chuck drills here. And so yeah, I could definitely get it popped up. I just need some type of um, female end to pop that bad boy up. So yeah, be on the lookout for that. Super, 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 super exciting. As I said, also been doing the Patreon. Got Patreon videos releasing weekly, as well as possibly more, more than once a week when I get more time. Like I said, I've been, hella busy so busy bro it's, it's insane but um yeah thank y'all for being here i really appreciate y'all like i said i haven't been doing too much i know bro Le okay let me show y'all let me show y'all so up here you can see i have some rust encap i have the platinum rust encapsulator paint so i already have the paint and i have the brushes to apply the platinum paint to my rims right so i got these rims there's gonna be a video of how I got these bad boys off because it was not easy. I know people people literally pay tire mechanics or whatever, tire techs, take these things off and put new ones on. No. My dad told me, never pay another man to do something you could do yourself. So, yep, we learning. We learned how to do this. We took these bad boys off. Only thing I have to do now is clean them. As you can see, it has like a lot of sand in the cracks. I need to clean them, wire brush them, and then repaint them. We all golden. It. Only thing is what I looked up is you need to have a lacquer thinner. I don't have lacquer thinner. I want you guys' opinion though. If you guys know about RVs or anything, let me know. We'll, um, I have some primer somewhere. I don't know where I put it. Oh, oh my God, it's right in my face. Holy smokes. But yeah, I have this multi-purpose primer. If you think this primer will work, look at my sock. If you think this primer will work as like a lacquer thinner, let me know. If that's the case, I will not have to buy a lacquer thinner. I could, I can clean it, throw that on there, 
and then we can get those rims painted. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to wait until I get a little bit more money so I can get lacquer thinner and buy tires because bro, tires are like 600 bucks, dude. Oh my God. Don't even get me started on the price of tires, okay? <laughs> I need a GoFundMe fund just for some tires. I'm still doing things. I promise I'm not just being lazy. I'm working hard. I'm working hard. And yeah, it just been a real busy time. Real busy time for me. And But I'm still doing big things. Let me know if y'all excited about the pop-up. Let me know what y'all want to see with the pop-up. Like I said, we're going to do renovations on it. Ooh. On top of that, let me talk about how dirty my air fryer is. First of all, thank you, Rambo, for the air fryer liners. Look at this, bro. Look at this. Look at this. Uh, uh, she ain't even dirty. Uh, uh. And for my birthday, I also want to give a big shout out to my mom. My mom and my family members, they kind of came together and got me a bunch of things. They got me this bottle jack. They got me a ton of stuff. They got me a bottle jack. They got me this new tripod if you if you watch the channel you know my old tripod right here broke a while ago so they got me a new one greatly appreciate it it's way better love it i also got wi-fi i got my own mobile hotspot my own unlimited wi-fi only thing is they sent me a faulty sim card so when i booted it up it didn't give me any wi-fi it just connected it gave me bars but no wi-fi so they're sending me a new sim card it's gonna be like another week before i get that like i said i was planning to do streams and stuff this week I can only work with what I got, man. Like I said, I'm trying for y'all, but life be life in. That's what I'm saying. Like, you can have a cool, you can have the best video idea ever, and then life can happen, and the video could just keep getting postponed and postponed. So, yeah, like I said, I really appreciate y'all just sticking with me. Like I said, join join the night. You have to join the Patreon. We're going to have nightclub streams over there. We got a little disco going on. It's bright outside right now, so you can't really tell the effect. But this thing will have my whole trailer glowing. So, yeah, you got to join the, you got to join the nightclub streams. I mean, a little microphone. And I... Uh, yeah. That's a little preview of what's going to be on the Patreon. But yeah, like I said, once I get my own Wi-Fi up and running, it'll be a lot more going on. Even now, it's going to be a lot more going on just as the summer starts to get started. Snow finally melting. We about to get into it. We about to get into it, man. It's about to get real fun. It's about to be a blast this summer. Like I said, this summer, honestly, a lot of camping. I'm going to be working, doing a lot of stuff. Um getting a lot of stuff prepared in the fall like i said august cruise coming up guaranteed already paid for it the cruise is coming so be on the lookout for a cruise i can't say where so stop asking me my little brother is going he also watched my channel so i can't say where the cruise is going or else i will spoil his surprise later on in the year i got the beat harvest and i got some really big plans i plan to visit the south again and visit my family a lot of content ideas coming up for that as well more plan i can't speak too much because you know I don't want to jinx myself, but just stay on the lookout. Stay tuned. Like I said, I know these past few videos have probably been seeming like filler videos. If y'all watch anime, you know what a filler is. It's kind of like where it's just backstory. It's not important. Almost like filler videos. But yeah, like I said, life be life in. I'm trying to do it the best I can. I just paid for the cruise. That money would have went towards tires. But you know, like I said, life is life in. So yeah, I'm going to get tires soon. I'll have Wi-Fi soon. The pop-up will be oper operable. I think that's how you say that word. The pop-up will be operable soon. And we can take that thing out camping within the next two weeks. Two weeks to a month, I promise. So yeah, stay tuned. So much coming, so much coming. I know it seems like, like I said, I'm feeling, I'm feeling, I'm pushing you off. But I'm just busy, man. Life is life in me. Like I said, I'm a supervisor here. I'm training. It's my first time ever being like a manager at a place. So I'm just trying to really step into my role and also not overwhelm myself because... It's really easy to overwhelm yourself and start to hate what you do. And I love what I do. It doesn't feel like I work a day in my life. So I want to keep it that way. Let's keep it that way. I appreciate y'all support. I appreciate everybody being so thoughtful, so understanding. I really do love y'all. I really do appreciate y'all. It's all for me today. RV away. Finger hearts. Out.